Parents are not expected to be psychic. But these convictions are not about poor parenting. These convictions confirm repeated acts or lack of acts that could have halted an oncoming runaway train about repeatedly ignoring things that would make a reasonable person feel the hair on the back of their neck stand up. Opportunity knocked over and over again, louder and louder and was ignored. No, one's, no one answered and these two people should have and sure didn't. Mr. Crumley, it's clear to this court that because of you, there was unfettered access to a gun or guns as well as ammunition in your home. You've characterized yourself as a martyr and threatened the well being of the prosecutor. Mrs. Crumley, you glorified the use and possession of these weapons. Your attitude toward your son and his behaviors was dispassionate and apathetic. Your response to school staff after a 12 minute meeting was, Are we done here? During your trial, you announced that you wouldn't do anything different. I understand that that might have been uh, misinterpreted, but it did cut the victims deep. In addition to the seven wounded, each of the defendants' gross neg negligence has caused unimaginable suffering to hundreds of others as a result of what happened that day. Each act or inaction created a ripple effect. Therefore, an out of guidelines sentence is appropriate and proportional. The court uses the useful, useful tool of the legislative guidelines, which embody the, the principles of proportionality, while also taking into account the nature of the offense and the background of each defendant. I believe that the following sentences would be in the best interest of justice and are reasonable and proportionate to the seriousness of the matter and the circumstances surrounding each defendant. With regard to Jennifer Crumley, it is the sentence of this court, Ms. Crumley, that you serve 10 to 15 years with the Michigan Department of Corrections. You will have credit for 858 days. State costs are $272. There's a crime victim's rights fee of $130. Um, you and your agents may not have any contact with the families of Madison Baldwin, Tate Muir, Hannah St. Juliana, and Justin Schilling, um, I will issue another ruling with regard to contact um, with your son, the shooter. <coughs> Excuse me. As, defend, as to defendant James Crumley, it is the sentence of this court that you serve 10 to 15 years with the Michigan Department of Corrections, that you receive credit for 858 days, that you pay state costs in the matter of uh, $272, that there is a crime victim's rights fee of $130, that you or your agents have no contact with the families of Madison Baldwin, Tate Muir, Hannah St. Juliana, and uh, Justin Schilling. 